Wow. 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 Impressive. Wow. Nice. Good size. Excellent throw. Wow. I, 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 I'm sorry. I didn't really have anything to particularly move this up, up thing up. Wow. What, what's, uh, what's the Wii Sports guy? Where he's like... He's, he's like... Strike! Nice throw! Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. You, you, you know what I'm talking about. Hey, stream. How's it going, everybody? Uh, hope you're having a fantastic day this morning. Uh, Barthez, never to be outdone, decided to be number one on the Twitch charts again. Once again. Uh, and thank you for the other uh, resubs I'm seeing here from folks. Theta as well. Pizza Portal. Thank you. I have not seen that video. It's the milk, but I'm sure it's very good. Um, so, stream. Uh, I've got... Oh, I've, you're right. I, I forgot. I have to do this. One second. I have to do this like five to ten times. The queen. The queen. The queen. The queen. The queen. The queen. Excellent. The cream. We've done it. I, that, that should make up at least all of the creams I've recently missed. Um, hello, though, stream. Uh, yes, today, this wonderful day, uh, we are going to be continuing with the Thaumaturge, th Thaumaturge, right? The uh, game from 11-Bit Studios. Again, um, sponsored by AMD and uh, the Thaumaturge game itself. And we got another good, lovely two-hour stream for us today playing this game. Should be pretty good. Uh, the the design of it is a really really oh goddamn chat the queen the queen the design is very the cream okay the oh shit wait hold up yo our dudes in the background now oh damn I d I did all right I did not expect. I, I, I didn't expect to see him in the back. That's actually really, really cool. Um, but yes, uh, we're, we're playing we're playing more of the Thaumaturge. As per the usual, check out exclamation point AMD to check out the game. It is currently out. It is a it's a very unique experience so far. Um, I've never I've never don't know really anything about like old kind of Slavic folklore before. So this is all a completely brand new world for me. Um, and you know, 11-Bit Studios, I think is a Polish company. Um, and so a lot of the games that they publish are like fun indie to double A titles, generally from developers of that region, which is, I'd, I'd say an underrepresented part of, um, of gaming, despite the fact that Polish video games are often some of my favorite because they're, well, they're generally dark and depressing, but they're like, they have a point. To it, which is fun, um, which is which is absolute, which is always a great time. Plus, if I'm not mistaken, uh, aren't CD Projekt Red also from like that region currently? And you know, uh, while they've had their ups and downs, they've certainly had more ups than downs. So you know, it's fun. So I I'm excited to continue it. Um, I I'm again to a, re a reminder for everybody. Uh, this is. Even though I'm, I'm very grateful for all the sponsorship opportunities, both from AMD and from 11-Bit and Thaumaturge, uh, this is not what's going to be my streams from here on out. The fact that we had three sponsored streams in a row is not indicative of a future. It's, it's just a timing thing, especially considering that I had to be displaced from my office and put into the merch office for the entire week. Uh, it is all just hilarious timing, and that's about it. Um, so I apologize, uh, but it is, it is what it is. And I am still thankful for the opportunities. Um, besides, uh, chat, I would, uh, la for those of you who may have missed it last night, I actually hopped on some, um, I hopped on hell divers with a bunch of the V Shoujo gals again. Um, because at the, at like 8 PM last night in the middle of the rain, Matara was like, go play with hell divers. And I'm like, okay. And so we got a good two and a half hours of Hell Divers last night. It was actually a lovely time. It was um, it was me, uh, Haruka, and um, an Iron Mouse, 
and Iron Mouse is a team killer. Oh my god. The amount of time she murdered me. Jesus. All right. Anyway, let's continue. Oh, hot damn. Oh, hot damn. Okay. Wait, oh, I don't know how to pronounce these things. Z Z Z I don't, I don't want to say like, I, I don't know how, how literally I should be pronouncing this because I don't want to do, I don't want to pull a K Kona and be like, Rizeka Wislaw. It sounds, it sounds like, it sounds like I'm, um, uh, I'm trying to do a, a Sims speech. <laughs> Actually saying any of these things, tr saying them like I'm pretending to be an American makes it sound like Sims speech. Rizeka Wislaw, Southern Sernazemeski, Pawaski Cemetery. That really just, it just sounds like sim speech. It's the, it's River Vistula. Vistula? That's whatever. We're in Warsaw. Go to your father's funeral at Pawaski Cemetery. I'm going to try to uh, run around and see if I can do any, because uh, they have that thing where you can like find cool items and stuff. There's a lady, a nice lady in red. No, no, she doesn't have anything. Ah, oh, yeah, nothing's over here. All right, it's fine. Polish is good because it sounds as it's spelt. Oh, thank God. That's it's uh. We we had a whole conversation about languages in, in the last amateur speech, and the uh, uh, e English is is quite a language, isn't it? Even the Brits can't kick and keep control of it. A Ruski spat in my vodka recently at the lock, stock, and barrel. At the, no, not the lock, stock, and barrel. So are, they, are they trying to reference the the, the film? Oh, what's this? The Daily Courier. The latest news. The chief of police of the city of Warsaw hereby informs the general public that in connection with their Majesty's visit, the number of units patrolling the streets on this day will be doubled. Um, in particular, constables will look uh, out for the groups of troublemakers that have been gathering more and more recently. Near major thoroughfares to protect against thaumaturges, and so on. So, how is this said? Remarscar, so on. I got really sad yesterday because my cat threw a pipe bomb at my Kairos Fate Weaver. What? I think she hates birds. You got really sad yesterday because your cat threw a pipe bomb. How did your cat get a pipe bomb? How did... What? Yeah, uh, sorry. I, I, okay. Okay. Remarska? Is that how it's... Is that how it's... Remarska Street. Police arrest 15 people who protested loudly in terms of traffic, demanding the thermometer to be punishable by death. The protesters were intoxicated and started a fight with the police. Units dispatched onto the scene. Close? Ah, damn. I don't know. I, words. Words. They're hard. God damn, dude. I, I swear. All of the old flags from back in the day are so dripped out. It's just got like... There's just... It's just so much. It's such it's such a baller uh, such a baller look. All right, where are we going? Oh, wait. Oh, I lost it. Oh no, I wanted. To, oh no, I wanted to read. Oh, you know, I was like, wait a minute, that looks like broken glass. Doesn't look like anything to read. Wanted notice all, to all police station chiefs of Warsaw: Beware of. Oh jeez, uh, I bear. I, a bear, a bear, a see Nidzik, Nidzik, Oh no, leader of the Shivs gang. Well, that's at least self-explanatory. They've got knives. Your cat bought a pipe bomb at the local Walmart. I, I'm, I'm being pulled between the the difficult to pronounce for my fucking California ass names and then the ball the the cat buying a pipe bomb at Walmart. That's what description: hair blonde, eyes blue. Okay, I'm not liking where this is going. Face round, stature sizable. Oh dear. 
Distinctive marks, dark circles under the eyes, signifying exceptional anger. <laughs> he is a thief and murderer, particularly active in the Schleid... No, I was going German there. Sr <laughs> Fuck this, dude. Whoever notifies the authorities of his whereabouts or contributes to his apprehension will shall be rewarded. Oh, we leveled up. Let's go. Oh, we have two levels. <gasps> oh, shit. Okay. Um, do we want to make like a balance build or do we want to like... Wait, action reaction? Inflicts damage. I'm assuming it's like an additional kind of hit. Adrenaline increases inflicted damage by 50%. So great events parts of the high damage point. You know what? My mind is too low. I'm going to develop my mind because I can't be into one in every game. Well, most games. Okay. Let's see here. Restores your focus. Plus three. Oh, damn. Oh, I already have diversion going on here. Old wound. Cast suffering. I guess restores my focus would be nice for the action reaction. And then bond of brutality increase the damage from the saluter's next attack by 50%. I guess let's put it here, I suppose. But I've got a bunch of extra random stuff. Ah, uh, Yori, thanks for the, the Prime sub. Uh, really, German hard as well. Also hard to pronounce. I, You know, I feel like like English as a language is hard. To, it's, it's a very hard language to learn if you don't speak English, obviously. But I feel like if you've only spoken English, learning other languages is like ridiculously difficult. It's almost like the reverse effect. Where learning another language as an English speaker is is almost harder than learning English as a non-English speaker. Because we, we've we dealt with such a bizarre language for so long that has a million, a million different uh, what's it, exceptions and so much slang. All right. Uh, change to Warsaw's Governor General. Today, the Supreme Order of August 28th was announced. The Governor General of Warsaw, commanded of the Warsaw Military District, Adjutant General Moskimovic, will be released from his current duties while retaining the title of Adjutant General. He will be replaced in the second in command, Adjutant General Scalon. I'm doing my best. I'm trying, chat. I can't, guys, I can't wait to play that new zombies map. Der Eisendrac. Mm hmm. The Warsaw Courier. Maj Majesties have arrived. When the city of the Courier is in your hands, the ancient city of Warsaw will be receiving its most distinguished guests. His Majesty Nikolai II, the Emperor of all Russia, the King of Poland, and Grand Duke of Finland, and Her Royal Highness Tsarina Alexandra Fyodorv oh, Fyod Fyodorovna will arrive in our city this afternoon. This will be the royal couple's first visit to Warsaw. On this long-awaited and joyous occasion, our cities will take up a festive appearance. She shall be adorned with festoons of flowers and greenery, and the entire area that the royal procession will pass through is filled with crowds of people wishing to pay homage to their majesties on behalf of Warsaw and all of their kingdom. And with that vow of loyal allegiance, Polish hearts send to the throne a quiet echo of fervent desires and lasting comfort. These arise from His Majesty's words, who declared in his grand manifestos that his ultimate goal was to ensure the happiness of all his loyal subjects and to discern all his loyal subjects' needs. Those gracious words of the sovereign have become a source of comfort and the people of the Kingdom of Poland. And in the name of that comfort, the Polish people under Russian rule are happy to greet His Majesty today, trusting their substantial needs will be recognized and ready for civic and public service. I'm not gonna lie. I don't like. In in a for in a lot of America American history, you know, you, you learn you learn about history a lot in in um in, in, when you're studying in the U S. And I vividly remember in high school when you learned about history. Freshman year was like was like kind of like old school history. We're talking uh, the Mesopotamian era, the, the you know, way back in the day, um, Ottoman Empire, that kind of stuff. Um, if I'm not mistaken, in my sophomore year, it was a lot more world history. It was the French Revolution. It was, um, uh, you know, the, the various, um, well, every time the Japanese emperor and shogun was killed by a, sub, a subordinate, um, Roman Empire, etc. But then junior year is almost entirely U.S. history. 
it's it i think it's actually just united states history and we spent i i'm not kidding we spent three i'm gonna I, actually i'm gonna move my my chat the, the chat is in is in a bad spot uh we spent three whole months entirely on world war ii like entirely on world war ii uh, now, it could just be the fact that my teacher was a massive World War II fan. Don't know. Not particularly sure the reasoning for all of that. Not important. God damn it. Did they like to talk about World War II? Oh, no, no. We, we did plenty of World War I also. But, but World War I was like a month. World War II was three. Like, it was long. And, uh, and so this entire tangent is entirely because... All of this interesting stuff here is our student talking about Franz Ferdinand assassination and all of the these, these the Russian revolutions and the Tsar. I gotta be honest, I've retained none of this. If any of you are like, oh man, that entire story I just read is about to talk about some crazy stuff, it went right over my head. I do not know what is happening. Uh brothers, the eleven hour workdays are killing. <laughs> yeah. Let's follow the example of the workers in German and English factories and fight to reduce them to nine working hours. Join the strike. Put down your tools and join the fight for our future. Harry. Why would I ever have that my workers work 11 whole hours, Harry? I'm a busy man, Harry. Snip, snap, snip, snap. There's a lot of things to read here. Menu. Cost... Uh, God damn it. Gazdelanska restaurant menu borscht ah oh, borscht is so good it's so good or broth fruit soup pottage with crayfish goose in jelly young turkey romaine lettuce pan seared saffron milk this place is fancy milk cups and cucumber salad ah oh, chai have you ever had a, a an asian cucumber salad at like a like a dumpling or like a sushi place where they have all that kind of spicy chili oil they mix it with oh it's so good Compote, cream with chocolate, pears a la Otero. I don't know why I rolled the R. Cup of green gags, green gauges, mocha, black coffee, local lager, English porter, portion caviar and snacks. Why is this place so fancy? God damn. Cucumber salad, ain't that just pickle? Well, it's got like a like a vinegar base to it, so it is a little pickly, but it's not quite like that pickly. Oh. Act one, the city that does not forget. My character just looks suspicious. Especially with the book on my hip. I just look sus. Why such a crowd? has come to town. These are troubled times. Brothers turn against brothers. Russia has had enough bloodshed. The violence must stop. When socialists attempt Wait, is to this divide the Russia the are? subject nations, to dent the sword that smote the enemy at Grunwald. This demands my decisive like, action. The guy? Thus, by my grace, I hereby appoint as Governor General of Warsaw Georgi Antonovich Skawon. A butcher. Uh. I don't know who Skabon is. I'm sure chat knows who, who this person is. I'm sure they can they can tell me. I'm turning the game up a little bit louder. Uh, I'm sure they can tell me who this person is. I don't know who this is, but they don't seem happy about it. Not a popular guy, I presume. I see you ain't from here. That swine keeps a photo album of all the folks he's had shot at the Citadel. Oh before and after execution oh well so the time for leniency and indulgence 
is over. From the moment this office is bestowed on me, no forces hostile to the subjects of Greater Russia will have any further right to exist. None, whether it be brutal socialist subversives, communists, Jews, or other satanic Ow. provocators. Oh! He sure knows how to unite a crowd. Pardon me. Are you Polish? You know, I'm just gonna say yes. I'm not. I'm not ashamed of my heritage. Yes, I feel Polish. My name's Victor. Wanda. This is Russia here. Like it or not, Warsaw. Premia terora zakoizos. Iti na koi. My first decision as Governor General of Warsaw. Aristovat. They're gonna kill that man. Oh, oh yeah, he. Oh, he's dead. Oh, he's so dead. Are we, do we get a public execution? Great heroes and their sense of timing. Of course, now they're the first ones in the fight. Samo bladanie, Puriaki. We won the treble. The Loutmouth. Damn. What happened? Why do I hear like change hey, dropping? Please kneel and tie my shoe. Proud answer. So you think she took you for one of her lackey? No, she she clearly has a plan. I'm, I don't want to be the pride fly answer. I'll just kneel. I didn't dare suggest it myself. What a guy. You you. What a guy. You you you. Shenanigan man's. Could you, Can I ask you a tiny favor? Doing so suspicious. The Russians can't find out about this. The military is just looking for an excuse to suppress the crowd, and these workers are dreaming of thrashing a Russian gendarme. Either one of you confesses to disturbing the peace, or of Sieg Zabirai. We'll take you all in. You can't handle all of us. Can you get us out of here? I mean, I've, I've got a magic book. I can, I, I can, I can. I think I'm open yeah, to any Yeah, I got a spell book suggest. holster. I'm kind of a baller. With a book like that, I'd find out what would convince one of these bastards to let us go. Or I'd take on that self-appointed leader of the proletariat. Interesting strategy. Who, who are you? Who are you, really? A damsel in distress. Those don't usually hide ammunition in their stockings. Oh yeah, I have a gun. Can I explain it I to you? I forgot I had the gun. Now I finally have ammo for my gun. For instance, I could disclose to a soldier that you came here with ammunition under your skirt. Maybe we should see who they believe. A respected lady of Warsaw, or a common magician who just a hundred years ago would have been burned at the stake. Well, since you asked so nicely, I'm going to take a look around. Oh, I was kind of hoping I would get a public execution for the random guy who spoke up. Request from a girl in trouble. Wanda, whom I met, kept the kettling incident, needs to help me help. The words? Pistol bullets. Small bullets carry big emotions. Hope because they were meant to benefit the cause. Fear, which in these difficult times makes it a way to even the hardest of hearts. It's hidden in the nooks and crannies of the undergarments with care and precision. We okay. Just like the previous time and the time before that, there's nothing new for the person who took the risk. Just gonna move past all that there. I don't need to know what the uh, what what the nooks and, and crannies were. Do you think it's a good idea to stir people up and send them to face bullets and bayonets? That's a very... You're just, what do you want then? Uh, you're just gonna go at him with that, my huh? Whole life on my knees? Kissing Ruski's ass? I mean, I kind of want to fight, but I don't think it's a good idea. The guy's there. Do you realize blood is about to be spilled? And that it might be mine? <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> <laughs> I 
it's just like this people might die and most importantly me i might die oh no that's pretty funny uh please bury are meant to help with uh keeping order during the rally and yeah, stuff there's the corporal and the sergeant we'll work our way up the chain pardon me gentlemen oh the crowd has received the order for now zero response we'll give them a moment to arrest them all book them interrogate them this va sounds Hopefully, familiar we'll be home in november gendarm readiness gendarms are ready to pacify the crowd they won't hesitate to arrest those who draw their attention the manhunt at the station the sergeant wants to call it a day and go home as fast as possible a manhunt entails a lot of work that he'd rather avoid with a little nudge he might settle for taking in the agitators and letting the rest go the workers leader is perfect for that role oh some of which, so i'm just gonna i'm just gonna give him the 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 leader it's like just take him and then we can call it a day gentlemen please forgive me maybe there's a faster way to get this situation resolved back off polyak or we'll start shooting. Paniatno, scrum. Do I? Do I have do I have two D? I have two D. <laughs> I can just I can just hand the, I can just hand Wanda over. I can just I can just give her give her to them. <laughs> or I can go with them into fight. Just like just like you know what uh, you know what this lady, she's clearly. Oh wait, that's actually interesting. I want can can I? That's weird. I'm, I'm assuming that this isn't a thing, but I, I wonder, like, if I could be like a Russian sympathizer or something during this, like, 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 a, like a czar sympathizer or something during this game. Like, that, that's, I don't think I can, but that'd be really funny. All right, accuse the worker. The status. Should we go Yo, in and boy. capture the worker who's mouthing off and let let us go? The sergeant. We can use anyone as an example. Shagom March! That man is wider than a fridge. Goodbye. You're welcome. I wanted to thank you at our next meeting. We could use someone like you. We? Meaning the people you were carrying ammunition for and who got you Dutch pomade for your hair? Hey, you haven't just got Victor, eyes. you've you got very good them. hair. Thank you very much. Maybe you'll find time one day for some jam donuts at Burke Rot Blitzes. Thanks. Fearless wanted a smuggler of bullets. <laughs> Fearless wanted a smuggler of bullets. What a name. The woman I met during the kenneling incident was smuggling bullets in the nooks and crannies of our undergarments. Clearly, it wasn't the first time. Unfortunately, this time the garter didn't hold and the bullets fell into the pavement. Maybe fate will have us cross paths again and we'll meet for jam donuts. I mean, I do I, I do like jam donuts. I do love me some donuts. Like, I, I am a fan of donuts. I do I do enjoy that. That's pretty good. Yeah, I, I do remember uh, gendarme was, uh, was a phrase said in Disco Elysium. It was said by the 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 prostitute uh guy i think guy um the 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 one that has the sunday friend i actually forget their actual name i don't i don't really remember oh my oh my goodness wait there's a there's a whole thing here what the heck smoker oh yeah smoker on the balcony smoker on the balcony that's right but yeah Mar martin martinez that's true wait this food bread I, i'm assuming i'm assuming the the bread or these things are uh, polish is not in cyrillic right it's in well shit, what do you call the english alphabet is it just you, what, the hell, what the hell do you call it latin alphabet oh latin alphabet okay i'm like i'm like what do you what do you refer to that okay so uh, wait, is it is this I'm assuming this is the Russian word for like bread or bakery and then this is the Polish word for bread or bakery? Yay, I'm learning. See, I, I mean, you know, I, I live in Southern California, so there's a shitload of places that are in English and Spanish. 
I guess it would be called the Latin alphabet. That's true. Both are bakery. I don't see an ass on that. Wait, someone, someone in chat literally named Laura Palmer said Latin, bro. Th that name gave me an absolute double take because I, I am literally, I just finished season one of Twin Peaks just like a week ago. Carnival ball at the public casino before midnight. The Polonaise. Oh, that's just too many names. Very difficult. I'm just continuing. Though I get more, I get a lot of XP if I keep looking around, which is nice. It rewards exploration. I'll go over here later. Is Sam like even more of a hack now that I've seen it? Uh, a little bit. The diner in the, the, the Oh Dear Diner is literally a one to one replica of the diner in Twin Peaks. It's genuinely identical. Like, it, it's like, it's the same fucking diner. It's insane. It was actually less weird than I thought it would be. Twin Peaks, that is. Uh, it has one really weird moment, the dream, but everything after that was, was pretty, like, normal. I can't get in there yet. Apparently, season two, and more particularly, season three is when it gets really weird. Oh, I can't go in there either. All right, where's, uh, where am I? I'm up here. Locked, locked, locked. There's a tram stop, carriage that way. I'm gonna try going, I'm gonna go down. If there's things to read, then I can get some XP. Snip, snap, snip, snap. Oh yeah, the log lady. The log lady is just Cynthia Weaver with like the glasses and everything. It's the same character, it's insane. Oh, here we go. Propaganda brochure. The sewers of the city of Warsaw as a tool used by Judaism and charlatans to destroy Polish agriculture and exterminate the Slavic population living by the Vistula River. The complete harmlessness of cloacal waste to humans is evidenced by the booming health of the workers, specifically those engaged in cleaning the laboratories laboratories and the suburban farmers who mostly rely on human fertilizers even during the spread of epidemic diseases so what room is there for the existence of these disease disease causing microbes they're probably dreamed up in the empty heads of tabloid writers or the perverse brains of the ill-willed amidst the manure and hay among the cattle and the simpletons the eternal wisdom uh, has descended upon mankind a mankind corrupted by the theories and doctrines of pure reason, by the devices and constructs of capitalism, by the skullduggery and extravagance of the Jews. And it has, it has used, used supernatural signs to guide the monarchs and the wise men to welcome the future savior of the world in a poor thatch in Bethlehem. XP gained. Snip, snap, snip, snap, snip, snap. This place is actually really, it's its really built up. There's quite a lot going on here. It's very, it's very rich in detail. Uh, let's see. XP gained, you're becoming a doctor. Yeah, I got X, I got XP from reading uh, propaganda posters. So I'm, I'm becoming slowly indoctrinated. Damn. All right. Gonna move around here. People clear people clearly like like their history. It's a lot it's a it seems like it I mean, oh wait, there's a tram over here. Catch a tram. Oh damn, you just take a tram. Is that take a tram as opposed to the Mermaid City's son thing? I guess you can do either or. Maybe the tramp costs money or something. I'm gonna go do the other one first because it's taking me that direction. No, bacteria does not exist. But listen, the, the brochure said so. Bacteria is not real. It's a figment of your imagination. You are not immune to propaganda, chat. Get a carriage. Oh, it's the same thing. Huh, tram, carriage. I guess there's two different fast travel points. Sorry, I'm an American. I don't know what public transit is. Never heard of it. Is that something that poor people use? Advertisement. Not even trying this. 
Uh, Warsaw offers first-rate decorations and equipment. It arranges funerals ranging from the humble to the most extravagant. Very low prices. Brochure, the Grand Derby on Paul Makatowski. You know, I'm just, I'm just getting XP, you know, like, look at all this XP I'm gathering. Hello, sir. How are you? Shady guy. Excuse me. What's going on here? Hello. They're burying Satan in sacred ground. What? Some of those assembled believe it to be sacrilege. Konstantia Shabowska, the Warsaw Courier. What is your opinion considering the book at your side? He's a tempermancer. Don't let him through. He sounds like James McGaffey. I may, maybe I'm just maybe I'm just Sam Lake pilled right now, but he, he sounds like Alex Casey. <laughs> Got out of my way. I'm asking you kindly, get out of my way before things get nasty. Get that heretic with fire and sword. Th these are the two men you decide to send after me? These two? These two schlubs? This man is late for his golf me meeting. He's got a bowling tournament to get to. Selecting yourself a salutator, you can preview both your and your salutator skills and how you plan your attack. Summoning another one. You can summon another salutator at any time. A grief frame or image means exceptionally effective in the fight with the given enemy. Oh, that's good. That helps me out in case I need to. Looks like it's, looks like it's Uncle Mr. Bones is the, is the one we want to work with. Uncle, Mr. Why am I fighting Gabe Newell? Yeah, it is Gabe Newell. You're right, it is Gabe Newell. Okay. Uh let's see here. I still have even more time to take his focus off before. Nah, it's PETA. PETA. The horse is here. I like Uncle Mr. Bones. Alright. Now we immediately just clobber him. Oh my god. Is this just gonna like one shot him? Oh no, it didn't. Wait, wait a minute. We <laughs> oh my god. Ow! Okay. Where is that other attack I had? Oh, wait, it was the, um... Okay, I want a quick attack because it disrupts their action. It has the chance of disrupting their action. So I'm gonna bop him. It's such a fun move. You just, you just hit him. Thanks, Mr. Bones. It's just, it's so funny seeing him, like, just bop him on the head, specifically. Oh, I, I can do suffering. Uh, I'll see this one. It's just like, like, you, you, he gets stabbed by, like, a spectral spirit. And then after that, it's just a right hook. It's excellent. Wait, wait for it, wait for it. Yeah! Oh, shit! Enemies have a trait that makes them immune to your attacks. Traits can be related to different dimensions, and they can be disabled. Disable an enemy's trait, attack them with a salutor that belongs to the same dimension as that trait. Note that if you don't have the required dimensions forced, you can always take away the opponent's focus and launch a strong attack. Okay, so... This trait is... What is this? Attack with... Oh, uh, no, it's still uh, still Uncle Mr. Bones. Okay. I'm gonna do Old Wound, because that looks like he'll, uh... I think that might cause suffering. It do. Alright, we need to interrupt their planned action, so we need to bop him in the face again. Oh, Jesus! Oh my! <laughs> I didn't even see that. That caught me so off guard. For his neutral special, he wields gun. 
<laughs> Holy shit, that caught me off guard. He did it again! That was so enchanting. Spectacular. You with a scowl and a puffed out chest, and them dropping like flies in the blink of an eye? Collapsing on their own, becoming delirious? Extraordinary. If you're gonna fuck, just Can fuck. Can we meet for an interview? Oh, Thank she's you, a reporter. Bob. Already late. Damn, I thought I wanted. I thought I was gonna have sex. Hey, real bird. Thanks for the resub. And you too, French fries. Fries? Ah, whatever. <laughs> okay, wait. Hold on. I got a level up. Look at this. Look at this. It's actually kind of, hmm, some of these, some of these upgrades are, are rather, rather interesting over here. This upgrade adds a point to the Dimension Worm. 60% chance of slowing the enemy's actions. Makes you lose focus instead of taking damage with a 4 to 1 ratio. That's actually pretty cool. I'm going to do that. Might be a handy thing to upgrade with. The thing is, is that some of these don't have... I've already done all the things that I could do, you know? I guess maybe I could use it on, on this. Might be pretty good. Uh, we'll try that out. Yeah, can, can we? Okay, so now, so, okay, so it, it was fun having uh, Mr. Doctor, or, or Mr. Doctor Bone, or Mr. Uncle Bones, um, but now I really badly want um, to see if we can get a Sciator with a gun. Ski family member, train stop, point of interest. I am going to go to that point of interest first before I go to my father's funeral. Because I want XP. Like What's better than pussy? A really good book. <laughs> Who says that? Why would they say that? After you, Alan Wake series, are you maybe going to do a similar deep dive into the Mass Effect series? You've already said you love the series, but knowing what makes it tick for you would be fun to hear. Uh, that's actually, um, uh, that's actually something I promised I would do after I reached a million subs. I promised I would do that when I hit a million subs, and we are like 3,000 away. We're so close. We're so close. Men's Taylor, watch the Bru the Dabludski. Except all manner of tailoring works, offering the lowest possible prices. Expect thoroughness, tastefulness, and diligence from the start to the finishing touch. Drink hot chocolates! A sweet aftertaste with a hint of bitterness, a postcard from the overseas world where the song of heavenly birds meets the rattle of slave chains. Oh, this is cool. Oh, that's neat. It's a neat, neat little photo thing. Also, hot chocolate, yum. Oh, no, no, no trail. Okay, I'm locked away. All right, time to go to the cemetery. Listen, listen. A good book. It's very important. Do, 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 Wisnowski, Polish stage artist. Neat. Tomb. Here lies Jan. Yep. Our dear friend. He met his end. What he is now lies deep inside what he was. Never you mind. A fortune. Right. Oh, yeah. I'm, oh yeah, I'm here for my dad. But, I, but my dad was a shitlord, if I'm not mistaken. I am here for for my dad, but my dad was in fact uh, a shitlord. I'm not gonna. So I want to apologize to the Polish viewers for my pronunciation, but at the same time, like, listen, no. Man, we are we are actually leveling up at a at a seriously quick rate. Look at how much stuff I can get still. Agony. The skill additionally cast the state on a random enemy. Suffering. Well, we do love suffering, but I'm going to finish this up first. Oh, 
I love how it's strongest Californian. It's not even about me being an English speaker. It's about me being an English speaker in this particular state. You're not wrong, though. Hello. I'm sure you don't remember me. My name's Hayat, Mordecai Hayat. I wanted to offer my condolences. Thank you. Please, forgive my prying. I know Mr. Shulsky took nitroglycerin for his heart, but how did he pass away? Was that his cause of death? His heart? Quip that your father didn't have a heart. I don't know the cause. Also, I'm sorry, uh, this, this gentleman here appears to have the, um, I do not remember the name, but the, the ceremonial, uh, Jewish garb, the, the hat. I don't remember the name of it. I feel bad for not remembering the name of it, but he appears to have one of these on currently. Um, did, did we not in the, in the, like, maybe 10 minute ride away, just see the Tsar elect another guy who was like, I can't wait to to get rid of all the Jews. Like not like he he should probably move. He should probably get away quickly. I hear Sweden is a good time of, of year right now. I'm curious myself. I haven't had a chance to find out. Yes, I I understand. My condolences once again. I'll leave you alone. I'm sure you want to bid farewell to your father. Yeah, I think he might want to, he might want to start, you know, when we were over here, he may want to start going north. I say, they say you have to cut off a thaumaturge's head after they, dude, he is literally dead. Literally dead. F. I knew you'd turn up. Thanks. I wouldn't miss this for the world. Yeah, you would. Stasha loved you in his own way. You look well. Liga said he found some quack healer. Yes, sir. Thank, <laughs> Rasputin? Thank you. you don't recognize me, do you? But do you remember who taught you how to shoot starlings? Uncle Voronin, I I'm, I'm sorry. Don't worry, I probably wouldn't recognize myself anymore. Go look in on your sister. She's worried. We'll talk at home. Sister? Victor. Oh, Ligma. What's up, Ligma? I'm so glad you came. I wasn't sure if my telegram had reached you. I'm glad too. Ligma's dripped out right now. now. All this caught me off guard, but for now, I don't have time to think things through calmly. Have you written to Mother? Yes, but what can you expect? You know what Nadia is like. It was never her style to show up for family events like this. It's getting late. And we've still got the reading of Papa's will ahead of us at home. And I'll leave you two alone. I suppose you've got your own matters to clear up. Hmm. I mean, yeah, we should probably say goodbye to Dad. Fine, let's get this over with. Even though we just had a vision of him. Look at him. He looks like he sells, he sells cyanide. So it was me who got it right in the end. Back then on the train platform was the last time we saw one another. 15 years ago. He, look at him. Holy shit. He is the most evil looking man I have ever seen. He looks like he raises, raises like high class cats for pit fights. He looks like the villain in HP Lovecraft story. He, he kind of does. He looks like the villain who was able to peer into the unimaginable depths of, of terrifying knowledge and was so evil. He was able to control it. Look at him. Look at, look at, look at between the, the jawline and the angry eyes. Jesus Christ. Farewell, father. Am I intruding? Look at this man's beard. What 
is it? Man, there are so many pointy evil beard people here. I was reflecting at the grave of my beloved father. You tricked me. I heard something else. Stanislav and I were acquainted. His name is Man. You Look at the say scar! I knew everything about your father. Mr. Victor Shulsky, isn't it? Your absence from Warsaw has happily come to an end, I hope. I... You know, well, you know, well, I haven't made my mind yet. I haven't had time to think about it. I understand. I hope you'll find some reason to stay here a little longer. Again, my condolences. He looks like, yeah, he, he looks like the, the human personification of name? the devil. My name is Kanyechkin. Ivan Kanyechkin. Goodbye. All right, chat. I don't know if that's an important character or not, but such interesting friends you had. <sighs> I, I guess I'm more tired than I thought. I'm assuming he's not important. I'm assuming this person is not important because no one seems to be reacting to it. The way he said that his name, it almost seems like he's a major figure in like, you know, stuff. Someone left an unusual note by the generic funeral wreath. Eat dirt, Zulski. Oh, my father was quite a nice person. Your friends in thaumaturgy. Okay. I mean, he looked like the devil. Like between, you know, he, he reminds me of like the shadow man from um, Black Ops 3. You bear the mark. You are cursed. You must place the hand upon the stone. Civil words contain a sea of set. Oh, that's a conclusion. Stanislaw's funeral. More people than I would have guessed came to say their farewells to father. It turns out that he had both friends who were clearly affected by his death and enemies who found it exceptionally pleasing. Well, it seems father evoked extreme emotions in the people he had encountered during his life. How pog. Good for dad. Good job, pops. You made people love and hate you simultaneously. hardest thing was getting the lid of the urn. The scattering I could handle. You can play the clown, but I know how much this has cost you. I'm glad you went. Love at a funeral? Eros postmortem? Is it suitable for a young lady in mourning to fraternize with bachelors? Who the fuck are you? Constantia Shabowska, the Warsaw Courier. Could I ask for a brief comment? Oh, that's who you are? You're you're I, uh, part of the of the goddamn Thank you. And you, sir? Can I punch her? Chase the hyena away. Okay, listen, okay. Come on. All right, all right, all right, all right. Developers, Thamaturge, I want I want I have a simple request. If you are who I think you are, this this is setting up. This is setting up. To, to punch her in the face, just like Commander Shepard does. The, it, it, it's setting me up here. Please don't let me down. Please don't let me down. I suggest you leave. Otherwise, I'll overlook your womanhood and make sure you can never pronounce a single syllable correctly again. You'd permit that to happen, Judge? Maybe I should write about this. And who would let you print it? Someday the press will get the Russian boot off its neck, Judge. I'm afraid none of us will live to see oh, today, I mean, my dear. It's a metaphorical Come punch, on, I children. guess. I'm sure my Pietia is already waiting for us at home. I'd love to see my cousin. Are you coming with us? Good enough. 
He's like, I would never harm a woman, but I might at this point pretend like you're not a woman and beat the shit out of you. Yeah, I'll come with you. Thanks. Get in. I'm sure the lawyer is already waiting for us. Northerns and mm, words. Wait, actually, I want to go look for more stuff if I can. Oh, that's a tram stop. Oh, here's the house. Yeah, I'll just go over there. It's just, it's just the snapping sound is so is just so satisfying, you know? It's just like snap, snap, snap. Miss, your guests have arrived. The lawyers upstairs too, waiting. A try for jittery. Wonder if the tea I made him was too strong. Thank you, Grajana, dear. Let the guests wait. First, I want to take care of the will. I'll just wet my whistle and join you all upstairs. I don't know what he meant by Make that, sure but it, 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 it sounded sober. like masturbation. And I don't think that's what it was, but... Either. I, I'm, I know that's not what he's referring to, but the way he said it, I'll Master just wet my Peter, whistle. Good God! Half your face covered, but I could tell right away it was you. You look just like your father in his youth. Alcohol? Completely his yeah, but image. does the alcohol Should lead I to masturbate? You, you know, this is a sponsored stream. It would warm you up a little. <clears throat> uh, you know what? Make some cocoa for, for her, for Lydia, who is uh, very, very attractive. Make an extra creamy one for Ligia. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I won't skimp on her. Now, your sister's putting a brave face on all this, but she's really having a hard time. It's lovely to see you again. But that's enough jabber for now. Chat, I'm I've not saying my character should... Got to whip up some food I, for you all me, we'll talk Bricky, I, is the character... Is, or it's the sister character is very, very good-looking. I, Mr. Victor, am not trying to do anything. This is not a Japanese anime. We don't bang uh, our relatives. Also, holy shit, look at my house. Well, not really my house. Look at the family house. Oh my God. I get to be a magician and extraordinarily rich. Look at him! Look at him! He's so evil! He's so evil! You're an aristocrat, Bricky? I am not a cat. And I don't know what being arrested has to do with that. Hmm. Well, consider we can move on from over here. Let's go ahead and get some more stuff from... A guy. Are you calling old men evil again? Yeah, evil old man is a great trope. I don't want to put my foot in my mouth again. I already failed to recognize someone once today, but you look familiar. Well, I should think so. I was the victim of one of your starling hunts. Voronins must not be very memorable, cousin. Pietia, forgive me, and for shooting you as well. Huh. <laughs> How are you doing? Just some heart problems, not a subject for today. I'm sorry about Uncle Stanislav. Forgive me for not coming to the funeral. I can't bear cemeteries. We'll have to meet up again. Goodbye. Just the, the way he said that. The, the pure, like, sorry for shooting you. The Warsaw Courier. You know what? I want to read this bitch's stuff. Damn reporters. I, I have not encountered Lenin yet. No. <laughs> We've got Rasputin so far, but we, we have not gotten a Lenin. Bust of Murata. Stern countenance resembles that of a human, but the cow... Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Marana, this this looks like one of the th the um the the suitors sutters whatever suits whatever yeah right here, yeah. 
Salutors. There we go. Salutors. Yeah, it's right here. They look really, really similar. It could just be a uh, coincidence, but hot oh, damn. God damn, I am an aristocrat. Mother's portrait. I'm going to say nothing. Wait. It's hard to believe the shocking vision of the painting must have been created in a previous era, a time when hearts were stirred with violent emotions, but tragedy, etc., etc. Father actually commissioned such a painting? Yeah, I'm pretty sure the fa father did not have sex. Ooh, dinner recipes. Yum. Hello, uncle. Are you getting your, uh, your, uh, glad you your vodka? I thought I'd have to drink alone. So many goodies laid out for the guests. Having trouble picking something for yourself, judge? But this was Stasio's. It was special. Amber liqueur with quinces. I think you mean quince liqueur with amber, right? If it's not here, I'm sure it's in the basement. But I won't grope around down there in the dark now. I've got my hands full. Now, I don't want to trouble you either. Victor, could you track down a little bottle for your uncle? I suppose I'm obligated to accept this mission. <laughs> Good lad. A nephew like you oh, is no. a treasure. We're 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 doing a we're doing a, a a fetch quest for Uncle to get himself some liquor. Damn, I saw I, I I just I looked at that for a half second. I saw ten pounds of amber. There we go. Is <laughs> finding all the liquor down here. He would not disregard any of them. Well, that's good. All right. What's up, Uncle? I got your I got your vodka or not vodka. I got your your go? booze. Mission accomplished. Indeed. Hmm. He wants the liquor. He got a liquor. I think this is the one Uncle wanted. Yes. This is our little funeral battle. We he already sounds Stasha drunk. Study after every funeral we went to and raised a toast to the dead. And recently, we've been seeing one another more and more at such events. More and more. But this time, even he has left me. So? You're right, the bottle is gigantic. Death, as Stasha and I used to say. Hmm. How did he die? Hasn't Ligia told you? I haven't even had the chance to ask. He didn't suffer, but such images stock in the memory image, stock are sound effect, for open later. bottle sound, my beloved. I prefer to remember him as he was alive. What then? Am I drinking alone? My own toast. Proud answer. I want to drink. May the ground be soft, father. I'm not betting there's an afterlife. <sighs> well, obligation fulfilled. Shall we get to the reading of the will? Uh, uh no, I need another moment. I gotta. You all have to wait for me a moment yet. I gotta do. All right, but hurry up. I gotta go talk to to other to, to sister lady. I think. Wait. Ah, wait. Oh wait, this is this is the going to the place for the will anyway, to the study. Bust of Siren. You think that there's Hmm Don't know if it's if we have that one. Well, it makes sense that the that dad would want to get all the uh because dad's also a thaumaturge, we'll want to get all the, the various things there. Serious photo. Straight back, stern impressions, nose on the air. Two boys that are trying to meet everyone's expectations. Something went wrong here. Probably dad's fault. Oh, there's a drip section? Oh my god. 
I didn't even realize that we could we could change our we could change our outfits. Hell yeah. Last one cost two. Bastard. Now that now that I know that we can be dripped out, this changes everything. Dear child, stop. It is with great sorrow that I have received the news of Stalinsla's death. Unfortunately, I will not be able to attend the funeral ceremony. My duties in Paris keep me from traveling to Warsaw at this time. Now. Damn, mom. Within my reach, Tom Megley. Mm -hmm. The Polish Gazette. Evening edition. Letter from Paris, sister of mine. I feel well enough to write something to you. The doctor also recommended I do so. I'm not alone in my anguish. I share room with one Refor Morton, who's... Wait, is this me? This is me, isn't it? Because it's the letter of a sister of mine, you know? Dr. Stewart's clinic, a very interesting case. He spends his days hunting for the moths, cockroaches, ladybug... Oh, my letter from Paris. Oh, I thought that was a titled something differently. Um, he eats that. He eats them. He says it gives him strength to wait for the coming of the Lord, but I don't think he means the Savior. I cannot yet reconstruct all the details from the debacle with Paimon. My mind is still in tatters. Him have visited me no more than a week ago. I know that's impossible. It's probably happened only in my mind, but it was so clear. He, as the king of hell with his host of demons with the shadows of his penitents, called for me to join them. It was so real. I'll stop there having a hard time gathering my thoughts. Well, it seems like our, our our man Victor is much more um, open with all of his stuff to his, his sister, which makes sense. That kind of goes along with what we were talking about earlier. Mr. Victor, over here. No. Maybe. God damn, I, there's, I, we have so much money. Oh, he has a family portrait. Goddamn, that's we still look so evil. Even when we're all just a family, we look evil. Oh, here's the last will. My last will written down the year of our Lord. It is it is my first and irrevocable will that my daughter Lydia will be appointed executrix of this will. Immediately following my death, let an inventory be taken and all of my personal movables be sold by public auction. Let the money so collected be offered to beggars at the cemetery. Everything related to the family business I entrust into the custody of my daughter. I do not attribute the manner of administration to her. I only wish that the business be small, not risky, and honest as I had run it. To my friend Alexander Voron, I wish to leave a collection of muskets and two revolvers dating back to the uprising to our first meeting. I also wish to aid my son Victor and entrust my grimoire to him, hoping that he will be able to make good use of it. This is my last will. Hmm. I kind of expected something more on the lines of like, and to my son Victor, eat shit and die. Goodbye. I am ready, Mr. Shulsky. I only need all of you to be present. Can we start reading your father's will? Everyone's mustache in this damn game. I yes. swear. Let his will be done. Begin. Let's begin if everyone is ready. Would you all please take a seat? Ladies and gentlemen, by the power of my office, I feel like I just read this though, but by the grace of his imperial majesty, the emperor of all Russia, I hereby testify. Mr. Shulsky's last will and testament were prepared several years ago in the presence of Zaslav Fedorov, Esquire, that is, myself. My last will and testament recorded in the year Wait, I just, of yeah, I just read this. 1888. But now it's just being read. In the name of the Holy Trinity. Or, yeah, maybe. Amen. No, I, I'll, I'll just let him do his thing. Therefore, my first irrevocable wish is to appoint as executrix of this will my daughter, Ligia Schulzka. Immediately after my death, an inventory shall be conducted in full accordance with the law. After completing the inventory, all my personal movables will be sold at public auction. 
And let the funds raised thereby be donated on the anniversary of my death to the beggars near the cemetery. The administration is weirdly of like generous for of evil dad. I leave without restriction to the person of my daughter Ligia. <sighs> I'm not even getting a teaspoon. All movables and immovables relating to the family enterprise. I entrust to the care and administration of my daughter. I do not prescribe a method of administering them. I merely offer her one piece of advice. I wish that the business should be conducted with modesty, prudence and honesty, as I have conducted it my whole life. A joke to the very end. <laughs> To my brother-in-law and all this friends. Oh, it's the Alexander guns! You get the guns! Lord, I wish to leave. You get the, the guns! Following. My collection of muskets and two revolvers, dating to the uprising in memory of our first meeting. Stasio, I will have plenty to do in my retirement. Hell yeah! Enjoy your retirement. A collection of muskets is the best thing. Yeah, is my mom getting anything? That's a good question. Now, Mr. Fedorov, what did my father leave my mother? Hmm? Victor, be serious. Nothing. There is a special item reflecting the absolute lack of any bequest to my former spouse. Nadia oh, right. Fedorovna. Former spouse. That's right. I would also like to come to That's the right. Of I leave to my ex-wife Jack Victor Shit Shulsky by entrusting him with the use of my personal black grimoire in the hope that he will be able to make good use of it. This is my last will and testament. Carry it out solemnly, though you may have found it burdensome. However, this last bequest poses a certain problem. Yes, it certainly does. And what is that, may I ask? I am not in possession of this grimoire. The late Mr. Shulsky used it up until his death. Oh. Yet no one left it with me after his passing. I don't even get the cool book. Meaning it's disappeared? Or it's buried with him. <laughs> Look at him. Look at how evil that man is. What in the hell? Did father have his grimoire on him at the time of his death? It was only because of the grimoire that we could identify him at all. What actually happened? How did he die? A building collapsed on top of him. Oh. I don't know any other way of putting it. <laughs> uh, can you can can you put on it? Can you? at least be a little bit more specific a building it collapsed on top of him how how did this happen it was a day like any other papa had gone for his habitual walk every tuesday and thursday he'd take a stroll to get some space as he put it when he didn't come back for a long time i got the bad feeling something had happened then we rode there together an entire wall of a tenement had collapsed. There were three victims, including Stasio, who had the bad luck to simply be walking by. To see him there in that condition, it's beyond description. Did Jesus, that makes sense. It makes, it's just the fact that he was probably like a, a totally mangled and because a building fell on him. Where, where, where did that happen? Where did though? it happen? Where was this building? The southern part of Shudmieście, not far from the police station. Anyway, you can miss it. So that's where it is. I've seen this place. I'd rather not imagine what condition you found father in there. Of all the possibilities, this was the death that fate prepared for him. You know, it's... It's pretty ironic, though. Yeah, like you're, you're going to be this like magician man, and then you just die because a building fell on you. It's it's just it feels it feels so simple and silly, but you know at the same time pretty funny. I foresaw a slightly more pleasant end for him myself. 
I doubt even he deserved such a horrible death. Well, I don't know. Look at him. Those might be the kindest words you've ever said on the subject of a father. How typical of a sort of person to keep a portrait in his study of a family that was only a family in canvas. Not long after the painting was done, he got divorced, ruined in Yejitsis, and kicked out his son. But there the portrait hangs, as if family meant anything at all. I don't know what exactly happened with Abauritsa, but I know that Papa felt guilty. You don't want to forgive him even now that he's gone? The dead need no forgiving. And as for forgetting, I don't know how. It's just a shame about the grimoire. The <laughs> man, dad what dying, whatever. But the book, damn. At least it's got a little bit of a, of a question there. Cause you know, you, it, it is a little sus that the guy just dies by a building landing on him, you know? I think we have to look for the answer in the place where it happened. It's a little With sus. With your sight, you can make out more in those ruins than I, or uncle, or detective could. This is a good lead, but is it the only one? Mm, well, there's also his stuff. And where are father's things at the moment? You're standing at the very center of his kingdom. Not everything has been sorted through yet, but you go right ahead. And the store? I should check the two. I've started stock taking there to distract myself, and I don't want you to go in there before I've finished. As you wish. Hmm. Well, yeah, what about the weird Ivan dude that looks literally like the devil? Father evidently knew a certain Ivan Konechkin. Have you heard anything about him? Konechkin? No, doesn't ring a bell. All sorts of people came to Papa's store. That doesn't mean every one of them might know something about the grimoire. That's true. You've got your work cut out for you. And Mordechai Chayat. Could that be a lead? I don't think so. He worked with father, but he left more than a year ago. I don't know why. He was an assistant at our, well, my store. Do you know where I might find him? Sadly, no. Do you have any other ideas? Uh, this is this is all I got at the moment, but I mean, it's a start. Going to the building sounds like the first proper now idea. At least I can see how little I know. Maybe these scraps of information will lead me somewhere. Well. Now that we know what's got to be figured out, forgive me, my darlings. I'm going to give my old bones a rest. Make sure you drink water, uncle. I'll see you out. Don't wake up with a hangover, not now. Goodbye, uncle. And uh, Ligia, I'm sorry it happened this way, that I wasn't close by. The most important thing is you here now. I need to go investigate a big old building that collapsed on my dad. That is extraordinarily sus. Oh, hey, what's up, Mr. Bones? How do you find our old stomping ground? Yes, I'm not too fond of this place either. This is where I had my last conversation with my father, just before I left. If you can call it a conversation. Can you see my dreams? Nightmares, actually. Ever since I decided to come back, I keep reliving the same memory. The Lone Shark incident. I'd l I've been it's, seeing wait, the, his wait, death look, there's a pog face in the background. Do you guys see the, the pog face ever. mask? <gasps> No, 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 go back. Shot reverse shot. Go back. Look, pog face. Check. I'm sorry. It, I just, it, it was, it was, it's so clearly a pog face. The human heart is worth more than the riches of the material world. 
You've gained F Chopin, Chop, Chop, Chopin, Nocturne, and something, something, something. Chopin, Chopin, ah, whatever. We got, we got music. That's all that matters. Some ancient cultures. There's the suitcase of many a travels. Chopin, a rich, uh, ritual stone mask representing the salutor known as Chiral. Condense is closed in the hope that clung to it first and the satisfaction that soon followed. It seems that father had plans for Chiral, which he eventually managed to fulfill. That's a creepy looking thing. It's got like a big old smiley face and everything. Like, 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 a, like a smile that has like, has, has problems. Oh, we're going up. What's up here? Yellow. Collection of books on the occult. Tiles include pseudo monarchia, demonim, demonim, mm. words. Father's search. Father's thoughts were recently occupied with the search for a knowledge that bordered on the obsessive. This is related to something much more than his usual curiosity about the world, which I remember him for. He was looking for something, hunting for Salyatoras, exploring the mysteries of everything related to Thaumaturgy. The only thing I still don't know is where it led him. It led him into the dirt, as it led him into a building falling on him. No, he's not, he's not smacking his lips to find cues. He, he's, he's snapping his fingers. What? What the? What? My love for you is burning. It keeps me from eating. It keeps me from sleeping. It keeps me from living. Leah, I am begging for you to end my agony. Agree to be... <laughs> she burned the letter. Ha. Leah had to do a boss bitch moment. All right. Downstairs we go. Someone's on the phone? Yellow? Moshi Moshi. Hello? I talk here? Do you hear it's me now? It's your spirit. Hey, he's Victor? back! Victor, are you there? Grigori? Yes. Victor, uh, where are you? On the other end of the line, at home, where the telephone rang. Yeah. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> how do you, how did you get this number? How did you know I have a telephone at home? Uh, something's interrupting you, Victor. I am telecommunicating with you to say I found lodgings here in Warsaw. If you need me, I'm by the cemetery. Uh, what number is it? Yes, yes. Seven Boboskowska Street. Uh, number seven by cemetery. Boboskowska. I'm glad. It's good to hear your voice. <laughs> it's good to hear you as well. Uh, goodbye. Press uh, I want to now. What do I... Uh, like this? Wonderful device. Remarkable. Hello? Oh, and now? Rasputin's is, is, is grandma. Actual grandma with the telephone. How do I turn off Zoom? Hello? Hello? Hello, sister. I would like to learn more Have about dad. anything yet about the grandma? <sighs> Smoking! Is there any way I can help? How dare you? Uh, woman's trace in the study. In father's study, I found a trace of a woman that I couldn't identify. Probably Svetlana Romyantseva. Uh, yeah, poofs? Who is she? And what does father have to do with her? Svetlana is a Russian aristocrat who travels with the Romanov's court. I can only tell you she was a customer of father's. A customer? If you don't want to say, then don't. Where can I find her? When she's in town, she stays at the Imperial Hotel. She might know something that will help me find the grimoire. Not so fast. To get in, you're going to need me and my connections. Well, you own Svetlana the entire company Swahe now because Dad gave you all of it. Wait, what, what is it? What is this? What was that? What's a soiree? Soir oh, wait, a soiree. How long like, did you say you lived with Mother in It's like a party? Like a soiree is like a party? Just a party. Yeah, yeah, like. yeah, I know things. Do you know what that is? Very funny. We could go together. How about... 
You track down some evening clothes, and I'll sort out the invitation. And I won't take no for an answer. You know, sadly, you never gave me a chance. We we, we really have a a, a lack of my over the top you. fancy parties I nowadays. Why can't, why can't someone Kuna just throw, like, a Victorian masked ball just for the hell of it, we you know? Also have barbers in Warsaw it's so in fun. It's so neat looking. something about whatever you have growing on your head and face. Whoa. Hold on. Hold on. How dare you? Victor is dripped out. Nice cock. How dare you? Also, hi, Living Legend. Thanks for the tier one sub. Ooh, have some liquor. Liquor is not alcohol. It is more of a tincture, in fact. Yes, a medicine. And since life is the most common fate of disease, well, to our health then. For you hosting a masquerade when? You know, for those of you in chat who are who are here or, or we're here due to the, the Warhammer world, uh, Assassinorum Kingmaker, when they had all of the knights that was um that were play or doing like the the parties and stuff um a lot of the the night households were like they they had all those those parties and stuff and they just seemed so cool the idea to be to be all, the, all these like chivalric people all kind of dripped out and all that kind of stuff it's uh it's really fun i would love to do something like that just kind of play the part you know well, uh, Wartez44, you you whiny little, little, little baby. I know that these parties are for super duper fucking rich people. The point is to try to throw one that's like, you know, a bit more average. Everyone put some effort into their clothes. Have a good time. It would be like a cool thing you could do like a as an after party type thing at like the Renaissance Fair. You find a good venue or something like that. Everyone has all their, their maid outfits made as an M-A-D-E. Yeah, you gotta get the gala. You get it. You get it. Maybe chat learned how to have more fun. Uh, we're going this way. Snip snap. Wait, what's this? Ooh. Oh. I want to see. I want to see more. You know. You know. We gotta normalize. We gotta normalize the. What was the? What was the name of the opening of the Fall of New Vegas dead money thing? Was it? It was a gala, wasn't it? Or it was like something kind of kind of similar to the gala. That's it. I'm killing this chatter. They're being stupid. Wartez, you go back to that dance and you find yourself some bitches. Maybe then they'll straighten you out. Get some stand get some standing in the corner. They don't realize I'm I'm clowning on on Bricky right now. Stop it. Where the hell is the is the goddamn there's a tailor on the other side of the place. Death. Why don't you gala these nuts? Why, I'm reporting you to my democ democracy officer. You know, I, I know this say the Sierra Madre, yeah, the, the Sierra Madre grand opening, but wasn't it like, wasn't it called like a gala or something like that? Ooh, stuff. Wait, did I just enter the ta the Taylor's area? Is are they here? Oh, they're over there. Okay, <laughs> it was like, I'm just gonna take your stuff. Okay, yeah, it was just a gala event. Yeah, it makes sense. What a great DLC that was. For story, not for gameplay. Excuse me. Damn it. I forgot to turn the key. Sorry, what? Run a lock up. You tell me. What? What is it? What? You... <laughs> Mr. Taylor, please. I need some evening wear, quick. Good proportions. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Alterations won't take long. Your name and address, sir? Viktor Shulsky, 9 Green Square. I'll send a messenger when I'm done. And Mr. Shulsky, 
if you'll allow me a moment of candor, as it often seems no one dares to address you with it. Sorry, what? Go and find yourself a barber in Povonsky. You look like a troglodyte. Oh my god. Now, I'd like to go to my business. Jesus. I won't bother you. All right. My hair is looking perfectly fine. I look, I look completely fine. What do you mean? The tailor struggles. The tailor has a steady hand for sewing, but his head reverberates the lack of ideas. He needs inspiration. His frustration and impatience won't breed any good ideas. The way things are going, he won't finish the job or find a creative piece. You know what? Um, I'll ask him about that. You okay, buddy? Mr. Shulsky, come in. What's new? I'm already in. I couldn't help noticing you're struggling for inspiration. You've got a keen eye. The book makes it easier? I have to guess what everyone has in their mind. <laughs> Is there any way I can help? I want to know what people look for in fashion these days. Bands, like Back in the day, you think it's a hell all you needed was two bad lags and bad. a space God for your Johnson. I don't know what else there is to it. If you tell me that, I'll be grateful. That's not bad, I'll though. I'll sue you anything you want in return. Anything? Let me sharpen my senses. Anything? Oh. I won't bother you. All right. You better be careful with that one. You you better you better be careful with that one. Anything? Okay, hold up. I wanna. I wanna I wanna learn more about the. Uh, uh, gotta I gotta find out stuff from the bustling streets of Warsaw. And that and that's how I'll I'll give him some extra inspiration. Listen, if I can be if I can have someone tailor me anything, I mean that's what would I what would I make for myself? I make something like really over the top ugly to the point where it becomes cool because it's like, you know, it's just so ugly. Locked, locked. Place of respite, point of interest, point of interest, tenement house. I'm assuming the barber is in the southern point. Hmm. Oh wait, did they say? Yeah, I guess the barber is this way. Not in the cemetery though. Hold on, where's the journal tell me I gotta go? So they press on at 11 Prozna Street. I guess I could travel over there, but it, it had, okay, now I'm, maybe I'm a little confused. Maybe it's, it's throwing me off. Okay, locked, locked, moonshine bar. Place of respite. Brothel? Oh, crap. Well, it says it's in, the, it's in the northern area, but it's also sending me directly to the, uh, directly to, to, the, to the stagecoach, so maybe, maybe it's in, maybe it is somewhere, but not where I think it is. I'm gonna go to the other points of interest. Maybe, maybe, maybe if I discover them, it'll be like, oh, here's the barber. Ooh. Food. Wait, what time? Oh, wait, what time is it? Isn't it really late? Oh, hello. Postcard. Brochure. Oh, there's a whole bunch of stuff here. Advertising poster. Or you think you can run a zoot suit? I probably can't run a zoot suit. I don't think I can really pull that off. It's a, it's a bit of a bit of a fancy thing right there. I'm not going to lie. Level up. Have some cognac. I feel the ratio of liquid joy to throat pinching euphoria growing with each passing moment. 
How just just drink you just, just walk up there buy yourself some straight cognac, huh? God damn. Oh, got all the, the mist. Okay. Uh, another point of interest up here. Make my way over. Do, 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 do. This is locked. Unfortunate. This. Changing the time of day. Oh, okay. Maybe I should. Yeah, maybe I should do that. Let's wait. Because maybe the barber is just not. Oh, hey, I can talk to. I can talk to. Let's, so. Let's chat. Did you miss the city? Wow. He has such a way Me with neither. words. Let's wait until. Let's go in the morning. So let's kill some time. Okay, I was thinking maybe the barber might be a. Uh, there's a new quest. You know, the barber might not be open yet until. Until later. Wait! Oh shit! Hello. It smells so nice in here. Food! Is that vanilla? Vanilla, raisins, butter, sugar, and some more butter. You're in heaven. I agree! Can I help you? Do you remember me? Mrs. Yagoda, it's me, Victor. Oh, I can't believe my eyes. Little Victor? Oh my, how you've grown I, and how handsome you've become. You see, I am handsome. That little cherub who would stand in front of the display. And so, and everyone else is making fun of my haircut. Pastries. Everyone else is making fun of my haircut. And see, I told you. No, I still love pastries. Confess it was about her, not the pastries. Ah, oh, that now that there you go, buddy. Mrs. Yagoda, as a grown man, I can confess that it was never the sweets. It was about you. Oh. <laughs> 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 oh. But to be honest, I have a daughter. So if you ever <laughs> Excuse me, I'm waiting for my order here. That's great, bitch. No I didn't ask. Be angry, darling. Just wait a moment. My daughter is taking the fruitcake out of the oven now. It will be hot. With raisins and orange peel? Definition I'll of my mom then. said I was handsome. It's the face only a mother could I love, you know? Not a thaumaturge. Let that be my sweet secret. That is all. Thank you. Goodbye. Don't you want to take anything sweet home with you? I do! Well, as you wish. No! No! I want the food! No! Have you worked up an appetite for a cookie? Yes! I was just passing by. No! I thought I'd pop in. You could also buy something sometime instead of just looking. No! Cookie! Good day. Have you worked up? I was just about. No. Come on. You need to look at the look at the cake. Look at the layers. Look at the muffins. No. My cookie. This guy is, is scolding his son. He's actually yelling at his crying son in the middle. In the middle of the bakery. He's actually. Holy <laughs> shouting at his child in the, in the kid is crying and he's yelling at him. What is happening here? I got to get out of here. You think the kid a cookie I could steal? I mean, he's already crying. Bigot's diary. 
Oh, Jesus. Okay, uh, let's see. Locked, locked. Two more points of interest I can check out real quick. Hey, kids. Bye, kids. What is this place? It's nut. It's like a library or something. So these little, little things here. What the fuck are you talking about? That man was talking about something about naked people and, and, and panty and panties and stuff. What the shit? Huh? Huh, cat? The price of adulthood. Every day I feel like blowing my brains out. Another price of adulthood. I will eat five scoops at once and no one can do anything about it. Brother, same. Wait, well, no! Why did, Why is the drawing of a child dropping the ice cream cone? This is not- this, this is not what I was hoping for! I just- I just wanted ice cream! I, I got- and I got sadness! Goodness gracious! Go to hell. What? What did I do? <laughs> he just, he just, he, I just walked next to him. And he told me to go to hell. The buzzing of the dog brings a dose of sobriety to the soul. Oh, he got that dog in him. Well, look at him. He got that dog in him. He's a musician. Wait, unironically though, where is the barber? It says the barber is that direction, but like, it doesn't really tell me where the barber is. I think maybe I need to uh, just travel to a different area and look around for the barber. Because it's not, it's, it says get in the carriage to the barber, but it has the thing here. Wait, the barber is in the cemetery? Wait, what? I thought, I thought this was supposed to be where recipe, what? Okay, so I thought this was supposed to be where Rasputin was supposed to be. It's like, meet me at the cemetery, whatever. And I'm like, oh, okay, sure. Then this is obviously the Rasputin's quest. But no, the barber is at the cemetery? Why is he there? Don't tell me he is the barber. Bro, if he, okay. Okay. That would be a killer. That would be a killer twist. That he is the barber. Oh, you got you got me. You got me curious now. I'm assuming a kopek is a is a like like a like a coin, like a dollar or something like that. Dead people need a haircut too. You know that's you, you that joke. You make a joke, but you're not wrong. Actually, that I don't know the name of the of the person who like sets the body up, but you know, lipstick with a carmine color. Does does the mortician also pro like dress the body though? Like the mortician, I know, like prepares the body. Like, do they also like dress it? Like, get the hair going? Like, all that kind of stuff as well. Okay, I thought they just like prepared the body, like did all the fluid and stuff. But then again, all I know is from the mortuary assistant, so I don't really know. Darn it, it's not Rasputin. I'm sad. Come in. Fancy haired. Yo, he's got the fade. Please, set my hair to rights. Yes, sir. Classy, classic disarray. Oh, man. I look so different. 
What a what a ridiculous change. Oh, okay. What's the closest to Bricky? What's the cl what's the closest to myself? Uh That's pretty close, but I don't normally have like the side slice. I don't have the comb over. Probably closer to this. A bit bit more of the messy over the top part. This is the closest I can get. Forehead's not big enough, though. The beard, though. I don't have, like, a 5 o'clock shadow option. I love how in this game, they're like, no, 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 no. You are you are going into the, into the early 1900s Poland-Russia combo, okay? You are gonna have a fucking beard. All right? You, like, you, there is no clean shaven up in here. You are going to have a beard. And you are going to like it. Both this and this are pretty good. An unruly part rep represents a reluctance to conform to fashion conventions. The top of the hair is styled with shorter size. The style has become increasingly popular in America. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, it is. Yeah, we'll, we'll do it. I'm sorry. I don't usually talk to clients. Do you like it? Uh, my brother, you, you should at least ask if I liked it during the... Yeah, it's fine. Yes, you're talented. Years of practice. My clients are always satisfied. I'm not quite sure if we should bring back suspenders, but they certainly work on the correct individuals. You know, like, suspenders in their own right, it, it's a very specific thing. I think you gotta be pretty built to pull them off, though. I think, I think you, you gotta have, you gotta have the tucked-in shirt, and you, you gotta have the muscles. I think you really gotta fill the shirt out if you want to bring back the suspenders, I think. But then again, I, there's also like the Monopoly Man, Oil Baron kind of look where you're like a really heavy set person, but then you've got the suspenders and all that kind of stuff with the shirt. And that also looks kind of good. So I don't really know. There's a, There are a lot of fashion styles that like, I think if you weren't as worried about judgment from walking around the world, people would bring in more, but it's like, like I would, ab I think that suspenders could be a really great thing to bring back, but I wouldn't do it unless like 10 of my friends were also doing it, you know? I'm down to join the, uh, I'm, I'm down to be a follower, not a leader. All right, Rasputin does want me to say what's up to him. You know, we should talk to Rasputin. Let's see. Yeah, I'll, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be a sheep. I'll be a sheep. That's fine. I'm okay with that. I accept my statement. Lesson in trendy dance. Ooh. Having an actual fashion style is a lot of work, to be honest. You know, you are you are right. For the most part, whenever like I don't dress in in a t-shirt and like pants because it's the it's the best looking thing. I do it because it's quick and and my mind is already like overloaded with everything else in life that trying to have a, a decent level of style is just it tips over the mental balance that I can that I can carry. To do shoes, polish, frock coat, clean. Or you, so you really want to dress like a stereotypical red or you see the difference between dressing so what what's the meme um like uh oh you're so sweet hello human resources that that's what dressing up is like because you can throw on suspenders and stuff but you can just be like an like a, like a total redditor like in the corner of a bar and 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 you'll just it just look like a, you just look like a goddamn redditor. But if you like work out a lot and put some effort into your appearance, and then you wear it, you look like some cool fucking I don't know like <laughs> Portland hipster. I don't know, but it's true. It's true. It's true. Hmm. Increases damage taken by fifty percent. Ooh. Yeah, I, I, I was about to say, what, what are they, what are, what's that old phrase they say about like dating and like dating apps? It's there's two rules. Rule one, be hot. Rule two, 
Um, don't be ugly. Hello. Indeed, fanciable. Hello, elegant Look woman. Close. I would even say a solid eight, wouldn't you? Bricky orchid eight. I don't know. We'll see when he turns around. Well, they're just gawking at me, just like just like. L ladies, ladies. Come on now. Let's let's be let's be. I I'm I'm gonna report them to 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 HR. May I ask what you ladies are doing? What everyone does. We're evaluating. Okay. A solid eight. You know, on a scale from one to ten, you look quite spiffy, sir. Why am I not a nine? Why are you smoozing with some sucker who's already suited and booted for his own funeral? Imports you, lousy Romeo. Fuck. Got an itch in looking for some philandering at the marble orchard, are you? Six, five. Damn. Zero. There's nothing here for you. Mr. Eight got some you know what, so he caught our eye. And vice versa, I can Th tell. Man has some negative Get ready for some shellacking, lads. We got a dandy looking for some a extra dandy? ventilation. And as luck would have it, not too far from the orchard either. A dandy? Sir, you have the unique opportunity of becoming a ten. <laughs> whoa! 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 Yo, hands up, you got me! They have guns! There's three fire! They have guns! They pulled out their revolvers! Oh, Jesus H, okay. Oh my god. Um. Oh my god, okay. All right, this is good enough. Okay, which uh, which one we got? Okay, Mugavak is is our is our fancy fancy lad this time around. Doom. This skill disables an enemy trait. Oh, it's so slow though. All right, we need to slow a man down. Which one is the one that's going to punch me? He's the one's going to punch me. Okay, we need to. Guns are just ones that cast bullets, so technically the military is a magic academy. Sir. Hmm. Yeah, we'll do some suffering. Oh my god! Okay, who's gonna hit me with the, the, the punch next? I'm assuming it's him. So we need we need a quick attack. Action reaction. Uh damage equal to the suffering state. Bop. Ow! Okay, so he's gonna attack next. Oh, increases damage by the Salator's next attack. Oh, but that, that comes after. Oh shit, I, I, I messed up my timing. Oh my god. Oh my god, I don't know if I'm making it out of this one. <laughs> oh my god, I don't know if I'm making it out. Folks, I don't know about this. Okay. I don't have anything to heal myself with. Ooh, I should have I should have gone with with Uncle Mr. Bones. I'm dead. I I I'm actually dead. Shit. Let's go back to the autosave.
Rip, rip, bozo. I got, I, man, this was all because a bunch of, a bunch of women were like, ready for the, right. Nice cock. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I didn't save. Oh, I didn't save. Oh, shit. Oh, it hurts. It hurts. It hurts. Oh, I think I lost. I, I think I only lost like 10 minutes or something like that, but I, I, oh. Okay, it's fine. We'll just, we just gotta get, we just gotta get our points back. Oh, hey, what the hell? I don't think I saw this last time. Oh, wait, there was, there was lady there. Save, yeah, I save often. Should have saved. That, that's all on me. Yep, that's on, that, that's on me. I screwed that up. God darn it, Bricky. Oh, I should have saved. Oh, I should have saved. Typical brick move. Second chance to get some ice cream. Oh shit. Yeah, you're not wrong. Ice cream. Ice cream. Okay, th th this is such a bricky move right here. This is such a common bricky L right now. Of all the thing, of all the the, the move, actually, what would be more typical of a bricky move? Would it be to like, like I, I feel like if, if I had the accidental ability to to attack the two women that were gawking at me, I feel like that would be more of a bricky move. Just like just like press the wrong dialogue option and immediately start fist fighting the two of them. That just feels like a bricky move right there. No, no, not attacking woman classic. Just like, like accidentally choosing the wrong dialogue options and attacking other people. You know what I mean. Don't you, don't you twist my words. Don't you twist my words. Secrets, not on my watch. Snip, snap, snip, snap. Sorry, I'm snapping at everything I possibly can. Just real quick. Okay, I think that's everything we need. We got here. Now I can go back to the cemetery. It shouldn't be too bad. Oh, yes. Oh, there we go. I didn't click it. Your flirting has filled me with violent rage. <laughs> attacks. <laughs> that ta attacks the two women. <laughs> How dare you flirt with me? Immediately starts pulling out hands and then combat music starts playing. Um, oh chat just so just so you're all aware um we are my my uh office fixing up remodel whatever uh that is almost done um tomorrow is going to be hanging some of the the acoustic uh, paneling and also um uh painting and Come so in. tomorrow it should be all done and then Please. we we should be yes, we should be all good um, it, it won't look particularly like much different, um, because Sorry. it's mainly I... just, it's, it's mainly just the, the carpet being added and, and that kind of stuff. Um, so it, it probably won't look any different for, for any of you, at least not that much. I'm saving. Um, that being said, it should sound better and, and you should not have as much of an echo and my camera will be back on. So I, I am excited for that. 
Um, I would immediately stream after after tomorrow and on the weekend, but unfortunately, um, fortunately or unfortunately, depending on I guess how, how you say it, uh, I have a Warhammer tournament this weekend. Um, and so I will be gone all day Saturday, Sunday. Uh, and so because of that. Do you call this a proper time for a visit? Who are you? What's going on? Hi. My name is Viktor Shulski. Sir and madam are already in bed. Come back in the morning like someone respectable. Okay. Fear not, I'm here for Rasputin. Oh, this is for Rasputin, oh. I can sense he's in the drawing room. Well, uh, hold on. I mean, I kind of want to go. So I do want to talk to you, Rasputin. <laughs> Bye. Um, but I want to. I want to fight the three dudes with guns before we. <laughs> before all of this. Wait. Actually, the two girls were right there. Okay. Oh, because there's a place of respite. I need to go back to the morning so I can go talk to them. I. I need to. I need to get the get the girls. We must. And I'll make sure to save beforehand. Let Hell yeah. Oh, there's a violin guide. Cool. Okay. So, real quick, I'm gonna go to my abilities here. So, okay. Because these are my abilities, and then there's my Thaumaturge's abilities. Um, so, so because Ubir, Ubir, whatever, is, is a vampiric style character, it would appear that they're mainly about giving myself health points back. Where Bukovac is all about inflicting suffering and doing like damage over time abilities. Um, so, I'd, it's all about, I think, adjusting that. Um, so we like the quick attack. Cleave of thought. Reduces focus by one. Dealing double damage. Now I want the one that gives it a chance to interrupting the enemy's planned actions. Yeah. And then the planned attack. We can do one that has them be slowed. And then we can cast suffering on them. Which might... Oh, okay, we can do a, a Suffering cast to increase the side towards next damage. Adrenaline itself cast increases infl inflicted damage by 20%. Cool. And then Strong Attack, we can do... So... Oh, wait. Actually, we could do... We could do a reaction to heal myself, maybe. And then 60% chance of dealing double damage. Okay. That could maybe work out. But anyway, yeah, no chat. I'll be uh, I'll be kind of back to back to the usual jazz um, coming up uh, tomorrow ish. Not tomorrow ish. Probably Monday ish. Hopefully. Get a steak for when your life is at stake. Make any vampire quickly retire. Oh shit! An Aspen steak for you, sir. With all ten Premium CMC wood, games plus DLC for about on the twenty solstice. pounds. Cheaper if you already They're own cheap. some games. Big W. I did not actually know that was a thing. Is that in Steam? Goodbye. They have no. Hey, please. This guy's selling vampire steaks. It's kind of funny. I'll talk with you later. Um. I mean, if they're on Steam, it's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, though. I think I think the Command and Conquer games are locked at 30 frames on Steam, which is a very unfortunate. But okay, we have saved. Hello. Whatever. I should have turned around. Turn around. Eight, it is. Damn. Will you show? All right, I'm being gawked at. Let's go. Okay, so yeah, I can't, I can't level up any of those folks. So the the singular point I have just kind of chilling here, I can't use on anything else. So, all right, let's start the fight. So. Reduces damage taken by 80%. Requires dimensional force mind 5 to disable. Wait, what? 
Reduces impact on owner's focus by one. Attack with Bukovac to disable. I literally can't stop this man from reducing his damage by 80%. Okay, Bukovac, I want you to... Do a quick murder on that man. This guy is about to punch me. I want to stop him. So we're going to do a quick attack to attempt to stop them from attacking, from hitting me. Oh, I did it. It worked. Nice. Okay. Okay. So right now, this guy is going to hurt me. And this guy right here is going to punch me, it would appear like. So, Bukovac, we're going to have you go here. I'm going to have... Oh, right. So, you have been afflicted by the suffering thing. Inflict damage equal to 8 for each enemy affected by the suffering state. So, I need more suffering. I'm going to do... No, Doom would take so long, though. You know what, in that case, let's let's activate suffering on multiple enemies so that we can buff it up a little bit. And then their guns are still going to take a while. I am going to try. Oh, it's a planned attack, but it could slower, slow the action. Oh, it takes forever, though. You know, it makes me lose focus instead of taking damage. We'll try that. Because then I might, I might, uh, no. Yeah, like that! Okay. Um, so who's next? You are next. I need to hurt you. So, quick order. Damn, it's a lot of damage. Okay. Oh, nope, I actually didn't want that. Uh, it's too late. Whatever. We'll try to bop you and see if we can interrupt your action again. That's not a bop! Ow. Ow. Okay. We need... We need you badly. Target's health points determines how much damage the skill inflicts. The more health points, the higher the damage. Restores your health points by 15, which is half of what you lost. We're gonna do that. This guy is the punch. It would be good to just kill. Restores eight elves for each enemy in the suffering state. Oh, that's really good. Let's do that. Yeah, the extra heal was helpful. Okay. He's fucking dead. Next turn. We are going to focus to try to keep myself up. Nice. Big heal. Focus damage. Let's go. Yeah. All right. He's dead. Good. 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 Um, okay. So we need, we need to heal ourselves. Nice. That will disable an enemy trait. Who's next? He's next. I'm going to focus on him so that I don't get take any more damage instead. And I'm going to do focus damage. Poggers. Ow. My focus is down. Which is not good. bop him in the face real quick. Oh, I broke. I interrupted this action. Let's go. Huge pog. Okay. Mr. Health Boy. Restores your health by 10. That's pretty good. Let's do that. Restores zero for each of the suffering states. My end attack does like, it does like nothing because he's got so, you know, we're gonna just 
if you disorient oh wait no we can't actually stop him from doing any any focus stuff though because we're out of focus points anyway oh my god we need to we need to interrupt this man yay hp thank god oh we interrupted him yes i got my focus back though yep okay who's next you're next with a quick shot so we are going to do that but first no i need i need i need more i need more healing Can I do a quick bop? I can't. Ah, he's you know what? We're just gonna we're just gonna use the focus so I don't get hurt again. Let's go. Huge pog. Okay, possible interrupt the the effect. You know what I'm gonna do? I am going to do old wounds. Oh no, the Sayator will attack first. We're just gonna bop him again. Yay. Man, our friend, the, the healing that I'm getting from this is just is just so good. Okay. He's next. We need to stop him. These take too long. These take too long. Hmm. I need I need to do this or else I'm gonna take so much damage. I think I'm on the hard I think I'm on hard difficulty. That might be why the combat is, is difficult. Also, I think I walked into a particularly funky six section right now. Okay, can I, does this buff? No, it won't matter. Um, also, this guy just happens to have an insane level of uh, HP. Ow. Slow, slowly healing myself is nice. We may want to start working. Oh, hello. Yes, let's do that. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my god. Uh we did it. Yay! I'm saving. I'm saving immediately. Let's fucking go. Um hi ladies. And I don't even get to bang. Oh my god. I wonder what the missus cooked up for dinner. Man, I, I just, just saw a genuine shootout like that. And it's like, wow, what should I? You know what? That's fine. I, I got called a 10. I got called a 10. Uh, bitches acquired, indeed. Bitches acquired. Hell yeah. Let's go. All right, chat. That is going to be it for me right now. Uh, I know the streams have been short lately, but with the office stuff and everything going on, it's uh, it's more of the time type situation here. Uh, thank you all very, very much for watching and being a part of the stream. Thank you for sticking around and everything. Uh, it's a really fascinating game. I'm not going to lie. Uh, now, I, obviously, I am sponsored, clearly. Uh, it says in the ad and everything. And if you'd like to pick up the game and you like what you see, go ahead and do exclamation point AMD for uh, the stream. And you can go ahead and see. It's on Steam right now. I believe it is currently asking for $35 redos, which I think is in pretty perfect double A kind of uh, price point thing. So it's, it's neat stuff. 
Um, anyway, that's all I have for you. Uh, you will see me. You will see me tomorrow for another uh, another stream. Uh, that will be around noon, which is whatever time it is for you right now, but 30 minutes ago. Um, I will be doing a collab with a few other people, possibly uh, some more of the v v Shoujo folks, and we may or may not be playing another Warhammer game. Who knows? Who knows? Anyway, thank you all so much for watching, chat. Pleasure having you here, and I will see you later. <laughs>